I want to take a second to show off these new racks uh, that I got not too long ago. Uh, these are actually racks from Adeline Rod Racks. Uh, they contacted uh, me and Trevor uh, a couple days after our Wither tournament, and uh, they wanted to know if uh, if we might be interested in testing out a couple of their racks and uh, see how they hold up. Uh, well, I just got done with the install uh, a couple days ago, and uh, last night I got finished up wiring in uh, LED lights on the back here. Uh, these are blue. So it's really going to make that, sh <coughs> that slime line pop at night time and, and really be able to see what's going on. Uh, the reason we went with a split rack uh, like we did was uh, the number one concern was uh, how much space that a normal rack takes up. Uh, most normal racks, they would either be mounted to the floor right here or in the track system right here. But uh, either way, it would stretch all the way across the boat in front of the engine to the other side. And from there back, you lose a, a, a foot and a half of, of room already. And that's not including having to trim up your motor for uh, trailering purposes. But uh, I really, really like this design right here. And everything went together real smooth. And... Uh, I believe they're gonna really handle some big fish. Uh, you could you could tow the boat around the parking lot by hand, just with these racks, if you could pull this boat. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show those off, and I had them uh, powder coated uh, after I had assembled them and uh, to make them match the boat. But they're real nice. A little dirty right now, but. That's Alabama pollen for you. So we'll see how they do, how they hold up over time. And uh, you can see I've got uh, some poles casted out. I've got a couple straight down uh, on top of a, a log jam. So I really want to see how they handle uh, a big fish fishing vertically and see how they handle the pressure of that.